plenty of bread. From 1 Kings chapter 17 verse 10 to 16. Whish, whish, dust flew everywhere as a little boy ran. The little boy was carrying a stick. One small dry leaf was still on the stick. Clink, clink. The little boy hit a little stone with the stick. The little stone bounced across the dry ground. The little boy stopped running and felt a scratch on his knee. The scratch was hard and bumpy. Then he looked at the stick in his hand. I want to float the stick in a puddle, said the little boy to himself. He wiped the sweat off his forehead and looked around. The little boy could see bushes that were brown and dry. He could see sand and rocks that were warm from the sun. He could see sand and rocks and bushes. Yet, the little boy could not see a puddle of water anywhere. The little boy began to run again. He ran through the dry sand. He ran past the big rocks and dry bushes. The little boy ran fast. He ran right up to the door of his own house. Mother, mother, cried the little boy. I cannot find a mud puddle anywhere. Mother was standing by the table. The little boy ran up and grabbed a hand. Mother, he cried, why are there no puddles at all? Rain makes mud puddles, answered his mother. Oh, oh, exclaimed the little boy. It has not rained for many, many days. The little boy watched his mother. She looked into the oil jar. Then she looked at her meal, which is also called flour. The meal was almost gone. Mother, will you please lift me up so that I may look at the flower? asked the little boy. Mother lifted up her little son onto the table. He could see the flower. He could see a handful of yellow grains. The yellow grains of flour were small and round like sand. The little boy also looked into the jar. It had only a few spoonfuls of oil. Mother whispered the little boy. Our meal is almost gone. There is hardly any oil left. How will you make bread? What will we eat? His mommy looked down at her little son. We have just enough meal and oil for one small cake of bread, said mother, as she took her small son's hand and walked outside. Where are we going? asked the little boy. We must find sticks, said mother. Then we will build a fire and bake our bread. Mother and her son walked across the dusty ground. Look, look, yelled the little boy as he waved his arms excitedly. I see one, two sticks on the ground. Mother smiled. She walked quickly over to the sticks and bent down to pick them up.